If m cubed minus m squared is equal to 294, then what is the value of m? Let's solve it step by step together. To solve this equation, we need to start by rewriting it in a way that allows us to extract a difference of cubes identity and a conjugate identity. First, we write this equation as follows. m cubed minus m squared minus 294 is equal to 0. Now, we can rewrite this equation in the following way m cubed minus m squared minus 343 minus 49 is equal to 0. Alright, we multiplied the negative sign before parenthesis by both numbers inside. So this expression simplifies to m cubed minus m squared minus 343 plus 49 is equal to 0. Next, we write these two numbers as powers of 7, which gives us m cubed minus m squared minus 7 cubed plus 7 squared is equal to 0. Now, we write this equation as follows. m cubed minus 7 cubed minus m squared minus 7 squared is equal to 0. According to the conjugate identity, a squared minus b squared is equal to a minus b times a plus b. And according to the difference of cubes identity, a cubed minus b cubed is equal to a minus b times a squared plus a times b plus b squared. So we can rewrite this equation as follows. m minus 7 times m squared plus 7m plus 49 minus m minus 7 times m plus 7 is equal to 0. Alright, we factor out m minus 7 and this equation becomes m minus 7 times m squared plus 7m plus 49 minus m plus 7 which is equal to 0. Now, we simplify the expression inside the brackets and it becomes m minus 7 times m squared plus 7m plus 49 minus m minus 7 equals 0. Okay, this equation simplifies to m minus 7 times m squared plus 6m plus 42 which is equal to 0. Now, we have two expressions that we must set equal to 0. First, we set m minus 7 equal to 0. So the first solution is equal to 7. In the next step, we set m squared plus 6m plus 42 equal to 0. In a quadratic equation, the value of delta is found using the following formula. Delta equals b squared minus 4ac. So the value of delta for this equation is 6 squared minus 4 times 1 times 42 which is equal to negative 132. Since delta is less than 0, this equation has no real solutions. So we need to look for complex solutions. The value of m in this equation is found using the following formula. m equals negative b plus or minus the square root of delta divided by 2a. So, the value of m for this equation is negative 6 plus or minus the square root of negative 132 divided by 2 times 1. Which simplifies to negative 6 plus or minus the square root of 132 times i over 2. And finally, the second solution to this question is equal to negative 6 plus the square root of 132 times i over 2. And the third solution is negative 6 minus the square root of 132 times i over 2. If this video was helpful to you, please don't forget to like and leave a comment. And to see more math videos, subscribe to the channel.